Fat loads of pieces. They're big in their cheese. I just want a cheese. What's one of him pineapple, mate? Paulie, this is a new worker. Dave. Alright, today's your first day. I hope Bobo's told you about this job. Yeah, delivering pizzas. You gave me the hot bag and the bum bag. Man, don't be so ignorant. You are dealing with the public. Pizza delivery is a dangerous business. Now, to stay alive, man, you're going to have to follow three simple rules. Listen, because I'm not saying them again, all right? Number one, if the customer, like, invites you inside, never go in, mate. Never. You come in, I have a nice hot tip waiting for you. <coughs> mate, rule number two, man, get a fake license from Habib. Can I see your license, please, sir? Of course. I mean, it's required by law. My name is Jerry MacFetus, with the Scottish pronunciation, Mac, because that's my background. I love them haggis. Now, the third rule is... He's them thongs. No, they're not thongs. They're cross trainers. Yes, they are. Look, the third rule is, Bobo is mad and he's a tight ass. And like, worst of all, if you see him coming with the chainsaw... <laughs> run, mate! <laughs> see, Bobo, man, he's a 40-year-old virgin. Don't tell him I thought you. Mate, that's why he's violent, man. He's horny all the time. And the bloke still lives with his mama. Believe that. You're telling me you've never had sex? There was one time that the woman had a penis. Are you a real woman? <laughs> and mate, Bobo's particularly stressed today because me and tomorrow, he's meant to get married to like a male or a chick. You're on the green card. The bloke is such a cheap ass. What he's done, he's making her sneak into the country, make like, like a refugee in one of them, what like, them little putt putt boats with a small engine. Where you walk, flowers bloom. When you smile, all the gloom turns to sunshine. My heart opens wide when you're gone. It fades Bobo, inside why you want to get and seems to have died. died. What are you blushes looking at? She's Any orders, Bobo? Shut up! Who are these guys? Mate, this is the former employee Hall of Shame. Now, you see this bloke here? Now, this is Dougie, mate. He was like the guy on them, like, TV Pizza Shack commercials. Yeah, right. Mate, after he got busted for drugs, that big scandal, he couldn't get a job nowhere else, but he's actually working in pieces. That'll be twelve ninety five. dollars thanks. <laughs> Killed by a serial killer, mate. Shit. What happened to this guy? That's Lachlan, the apprentice chef. He suffered like an industrialised accident. Unlucky. Now this bloke here, he's still alive. The man, he was the biggest stooge of a pizza guy you've ever seen. You know, like, he was too polite. Hey, <laughs> 
how many times did I tell him there? These people hear their bums. There's no room for etiquette in this area. Excuse me, madam. Could you be so kind as to tell me where is the front road, please? It's far wrong. He's trying to rape me, kid. And the didn't even offer me a beer. Let's get the. Basically, man, he had no chalky toughness, mate. You need that. Chalky, what's that? Well, chalk onus, man. It's like the opposite of anglicised. Like, you would be anglicised. I would be choco.